Okay, it is Wednesday, but for you it'll be Thursday, but whatever. Uh, yesterday was a rest day, so I figured it's fun to do a video. <laughs> not, not much to tell you. Um, this week has been going really well. Um, aside from the whole sleeping thing and being kind of sick a couple of days ago, but it seems I seem to be over that. Um, today I've been awake since, well, I, I got like four hours sleep last night. I've been up since like six o'clock, uh, did a workout. I haven't felt tired all day. Um, had a couple of meetings. Day has gone pretty well. Um, just one little thing I found today that I think, I think I have a new favorite exercise, um, which is weird. Well, the reason why I like it is, is weird. Um, it's uh, a dumbbell pullover, so it's when you're, you're on your back, for anybody who doesn't know what I'm talking about. For those of you who do know what I'm talking about, obviously you know what I'm talking about. For those of you who don't, here you go. Uh, a dumbbell pullover is like when you're on your back, um, either laying on a bench or using your shoulders to hold yourself on a bench with your knees bent out front. Um, I'm not that skilled yet, uh, so I'm laying on the bench. Uh, but then you take a weight, and you pull it all the way behind your head, and then you have to lift it forward. Um, even right there, I can feel it. So it works, it works a lot of the lats, and that was the coolest part about this exercise, because you know, I've done lots of like pull downs and stuff before, and you can feel the lat kind of work that way, but by doing this, by doing this, uh, this movement, I could feel my lats on either side, like, I could feel them pump. And so as you would move and go through the exercise, you could feel the, like this muscle on your back actually move. Um, and it was kind of a neat feeling. The, the first time it happened, I was wondering what the hell that was. Um, and then I realized, hey, it's a muscle. Uh, so that was cool. Feeling muscles work is a pretty neat feeling and it's just, where that where the lat sits it just it's it's i don't know if if you've if you've done that before and you felt it you know what i'm talking about um <laughs> but uh like i say this week has been going really well um i don't know how much weight i've lost i've i've been an idiot and i've kind of peaked at the scale um and i don't my my weight isn't i, I so far i haven't dropped nearly as much as i dropped last week um, I don't know if that's because last week was a big shock and I lost a bunch of water weight or if it's because this week my diet's changed a bit. This week I introduced a bit more vegetables. Um, I've had a number of, um, number of village salads uh, this week as I've, I've talked about. Um, but I, so I, I'm going to see next week I'm going to kind of kick, get rid of the salads and stick more to the fats and stuff. Um, I mean, I haven't gone over my carbs, at least according to my, my macros. Like, I, I track everything still. Um, but for some reason this week, f for whatever reason this week, uh, it doesn't seem to be dropping the weight like I did last week. I mean, I'll, I'll be doing my measurements tomorrow. Uh, Thursday's my weigh-in day. So I'll find out uh, how my measurements have gone. I do feel a little bit tinier. Um, like, I posted a picture of the day. I put on a pair of jeans I haven't worn in months. So there is, there is still, um, you know, I'm still moving forward, but uh, I, I, scale wise, I don't, haven't seen much of a change. Um, but again, that could be because of a lot of water weight at first, could be diet. Um, but next week I'll, next week I'll cut out the uh, salads, go back to how I was really eating week one and just see if that affects it all. If it doesn't affect it, then I know it was just a, a shock and water weight week one and you know, it's gonna be more, <laughs> I'm not gonna be losing eight pounds a week even though, you know, that would be kind of cool. If I could lose eight pounds a week um, in six months, I would be in fantastic shape. <laughs> but I just, you know, keep going at it. Uh, as you may notice, I finally trimmed my beard. Um, I gotta, I just gotta cut my hair because I have old man hair now. 
I used to have a, I used to have a head of hair, and now I don't have a head of hair anymore. So um, this is going to be getting probably shaved down in the next next few days. Um, yeah. Anybody? Uh, just before I go, um, anybody out there who has anything to do with an apparel company, um, get at me because there's some things I've been thinking about doing about uh, getting my own branded. Um, well, sorry about that. But getting my own branded. Uh, athletic stuff like working out and everything. Um, so if anyone knows anyone, um, tell them to tell them to contact me. Um, yeah, kind of want to like find my own own fitness wear. Um, but again, if, uh, like and subscribe. If you'd share this, um, the journey continues. Um, and tomorrow we will. Tomorrow will, well, I guess, tomorrow for me, in two days for you, we'll, uh, we'll see how week two has, uh, has gone for me. Um, I can't believe, <laughs> I can't believe it's already been two weeks. So by the time you see the next video, I will have done my 14th or 15th workout in, what, 17 days, 18 days? Um, that is definitely a personal record. All right, again, if you can share, like and subscribe, or dislike, whatever, throw me a comment. Uh, you know, I, I try to reply to everybody. Well, I do reply to everybody, because not many people message me. But uh, leave a comment, I'll get back to you, and uh, you know, whatever questions you have, I'd be glad to answer. Um, any tips, any suggestions, you know, I'm always all ears. Um, and thanks, take care.